everybody really wants is a little security. A chance to live comfortably until the next unavoidable tragedy unavoidably hits and splices open our chest and takes the veins from our legs and carves up our heart in the name of vicious surgery or, or murder. Murder! Murderer! Was I this lonely as a child? My bones are lonely now. Pointing to a white flag with a brown bear on it, the teacher tells us, this is our state flag. In my class, everybody are born in America. We pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States. The teacher tells us, the sequoia is our state tree, that they are the tallest trees in the world. Wonder about a, a boy I knew in kindergarten. So short him have trouble climbing him seat. Is he lonely now? Like a Ferris wheel abandoned in the rain? As a child, I liked those things, see? Eh? Ferris wheel, cotton candy, crinoline musketeers. I wonder, was my brother always lonely? Ever? Was he cold the night, the years him walk alone? Did he think about his childhood? Did him think it was it was insane. Did the voices writing in a wind comfort him or drive him like a shepherd over concrete collecting aluminum cans? You smile for a while, feeling ever so American and in good company as you eat compulsively. After all, the whole country does it. It's just past the head until you get your x-ray or your biopsy back. Making the world safe for democracy, huh? And you can't even avoid heart disease until you're 40 and it attacks while walking on those big expensive sneakers niggers wear as they shove a pawn shop gun to your head and say, give me everything you got. And for once, you're not afraid because the nigger has AIDS. And you laugh triumphantly. Finally, you've given him and the world everything you got. The golden poppy is our state flower. California is the second largest state in the Union. The teacher, where is she now, eh? Is she old, dead? Did she die drinking? Or did she complete 25 years of talking to lonely, desperate people in baby bodies about the kind of clouds and arithmetic and verbs and George Washington, eh? Did she know we'd end up rainy-eyed, homeless, wandering through state forests, trying to find the trees in that she taught us were ours? <laughs> <laughs>